Hikage. Well, if it isn't Morakumo. Hmm. 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 Don't people usually start conversations when they run into each other like this? Sure, let's chat. All right. Hmm. <laughs> Anything you want to talk about? Not really. Me either. Hmm. <clears throat> Bean sprouts. Bean sprouts? Let's play last letter, first letter. Here, Morokomo. Sprouts. Sp s Mr. Seahorse. Nope. No proper nouns. Fine, then. Just seahorse. Elephant. T T T Mr. Tiger. You like putting Mr. in front of your animals, don't you? Sorry, it's a habit. Just disregard the Mr. from here on in. Let's see. R. 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 Rival. L. L. Mr. Lenkophosaurus! What's that? A dinosaur that lived in the early Jurassic period. Oh, huh. You know your stuff. Skirt with a machined machine gun. Sentences are okay, too? I always played it one noun only. All right, skirt. But then you have to drop the mister. Oh, off topic, Hikage. We're surrounded by enemies. Oh, huh. We are. Looks like they're ready to go. It seems we'll have to oblige them, then. Yeah, okay. Let's do what we can here. So I won the word game, right? Not yet. The battle's just getting started. But I am impressed, Murakamo. How so? You kept up with all my words. That's admirable. It's not my skills. It's thanks to Siberia. No, it's because you knew so much about animals. I really respect that. Really? But you were strong too, Hikage. I lost this time, but the next time we face off, I'll win. Yeah, let's do this again. Oh, those people who attacked us just now. Do you have any idea who they were? No, but I guess it doesn't matter. Yeah, you're right. See you later, then. Sure thing. <laughs> What's wrong, Homura? Well, lately, a lot of the time, I've been feeling like I'm the only one who gives a shit. Are you feeling that way right now? Yeah, and what if I am? This is serious! It doesn't take much to stir your passions, does it? Oh, right. Sorry. No. There's no need to worry about it. All we have to do is look ahead and, and keep moving forward as usual. We? 
Well, there's something on my mind as well. You too? What's that? My speech is far too flowery. Oh, so you know that. What? So it's true! I had feared that everyone thought so, but now I know for certain. Ah, I should have curbed my poeticism long ago. Now it's too late. Such humiliation. Whoa, come on. Chill out. You just said it yourself. All we have to do is look ahead and keep moving forward as usual. So don't worry about what other people think. Of course. You're right. So, as usual, what do you say we go around? As usual. No fear, Miyabi. All we gotta do is keep charging down our paths of the Shinobi. <laughs> to endure the indifference of the masses. To strive for the power of passion. To grasp the sword of revolution. Miyabi, you get me! Indeed, your words were as a kiss from a bright thorned rose which drew the blood from my lips and let it flow to my heart! That's it, Miyabi! You're setting my soul on fire! Burn through! I'm an Abruska! And lift this fallen angel's wings from your rising heat! There may be those who point and laugh at me, those who steer our lives by the light in our fiery urges! But, but I care not for them. One day, a new generation will look back upon us with awe and respect. So for now, let us go on forward! Let us venture forth, Homura. Fate itself is in our hands. That whole speech got me right here! Enemy, you're no longer our enemy. You're one of us. That's right. I would go so far as to proclaim that we share the self-same soul. Aww, I'm so, so honored! Eee, so happy! Oi, snap out of it, Hanabe! Kindly put your happiness aside for now. We face a dreadful enemy ahead, one without form or substance. We're up against the public eye, an enemy much stronger than any other giant Yoma. Knowing that, Hanabi, do you still commit? Of course. I don't care what others think of me. Miyabi, looks like the fire from our souls is already spreading out. Indeed. No life, no shinobi. That is the only way to melt this frozen world. No life, no shinobi! Anabe! One day, you will come to understand, Renka. You will see that only the noble path remains. If you want to live passionately, come ask us any time. Our doors will always be open. We'll introduce you to some part-time jobs. Ugh. Now, off to the next battlefield! Our struggle is only getting started! Yeah! Hip hip hooray! Whatever, they're just fooling around. They're probably harmless. I'd be able to find with them. Why do you look like that, Ryo? 
Yoda? Did something happen? Yo! Yummy! I'm gonna lick you up! Pero, 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 pero! Uh, Yomi! Run! Ah! I've been licked all over! Kyo, kyo, kyo! Pero, 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 pero! Huh? Please, stop. Oh, oh no! The beast all is spreading! What is this? Everyone, take shelter! Kyo! This is getting kind of fun! Kyo, kyo! Let's all be animals! Hey! What's going on? Oh my, such adorable animals. Adorable, maybe, but... That one has Yomi's face. Could this be Haruka's doing? Yes, right. That's just the right question to ask. How do I say this? Excuse me. Asuka, let's you and I restrain Riona's rampage for now. Right! Ah! Not like that! Kyo, kyo, kyo! If you're gonna restrain me, don't hold me down! Use a rope! If you touch... What? This is... Oh my. Well, this is dangerous. Hmm. What to do? <gasps> Aha! This ball should fix everything! But it might be a bit of a challenge to do it all myself. If only there was someone willing to help me out. Excuse me, you there. Can I borrow you for a moment? These poor girls have gone astray. At this rate, they're going to change into real animals. First, you need to stimulate their minds gently by talking with them. And once you awaken their human consciousness... This ball is called the Peach Ball. With the proper vibrational force, it'll produce a special mist that can restore their humanity. So, would you help me out? Hmm, how do you create the proper vibrational force? Let's see, maybe we can use the pinball machine. I secretly modified the machine, you see. Just on the off chance that this might happen. This place is usually rather vacant, so I have the time for it. Now, we simply need to lure the girls on top of the machine and let the mist do its work. Hikage? Where are you, Hikage? Haruka? Ah, yes, Yomi. You've entered as well. By the way, do you know where Hikage is? I... I do not know. That expression... You do know if I'm not mistaken. Even if I did, I cannot tell you, Haruka. And, Haruka, I must say, you're looking rather menacing right now. <laughs> ah! Perfect timing. I should have a little appetizer before moving on to Hikage. Yomi, you look so delicious. <laughs> what a sinister aura! If I lose, I don't want to imagine the consequences! Ha, ha, ha.
Huh. No. Now then, I'm going to have you test this, Yomi. What did I do to her sense of humor? This is a complete failure. Back to the drawing board. Thank goodness I tested it on Yomi first. Droughts! Droughts! They're bad for bean sprouts! Eh? Eh? <laughs> There's no time for this. Best to leave her here until it wears off. Keep them laughing, Yomi. <laughs> Hikage, I found you at last. You're really annoying. You know that, Haruka? Now, to make you drink this. To make you dance. Samba to rumbo to jitterbug to waltz. A whole carnival rolled into one. Why does it have to be me? Anyone can do that. Don't you know anybody else who might actually want to dance? <laughs> you don't understand at all, do you, Hikage? It's no fun if I use it on people who want to dance. You got a problem right there. <laughs> you have no idea, but I can't stop. I won't stop. Now drink, Hikage. <coughs> so, do you want to dance? Uh, uh, it's that feeling again. No. I don't want this. Success. Time to start the carnival. No. My body's moving on its own. Sa. Sa. Samba!